everybody, this is MQR MQR playing. I, this game doesn't really have a name. It's A G A R dot I O. Um, link I saw like in Zoom Avoid I think video on this, and now I'm addicted. So I think I'm just gonna go ahead and make a video on it. Um, so. Basically, it's sort of a, it's a pretty simple game. Basically, you are like a blob, and you can like eat like smaller blobs, but bigger blobs can eat you, I guess. That you could like split. <laughs> um, yes, and so yeah, so I'm gonna do some free for all games. So that means so this does include other players. Um, I think in the settings I'm gonna go ahead and turn off names. That's because I don't really want profanity. Um, my videos. Let's see and show mass. Um, playing on the U.S. I'm playing as Doge. And Doge is um, yeah, basically if you select your name to that, you have a Doge skin. So U.S. West. Um, I guess here I go. I'm Doge, as you see, I move my mouse around and try to collect all the dots I can, trying to avoid the bigger figures. Um, for now, I just start out collecting dots. In a second, I'll have the ability to maybe, um, oh, well, you see, that person released a uh, orb and killed me there. But maybe in a second, I'll have the ability to, um, it called um start actually attacking other players that person oh that that person is actually really helping me there oh now I died there um yeah that person was actually really helping me there for a second though yep oh yeah so this seems like a fairly populated server so far. Um, probably don't try to just avoid at all costs other players for now until I get um, a bit more powerful here. Um, the one complaint about this game I have is that there's invisible walls. But as you see the level, the level there is like increasing my sort of blob size and as that increases um, I'll get more ability. Uh, yes, anyway. So, I don't know. Such orbs. Many colors. I don't know. That was a... F okay. Such. Such orb. Many blob. Oh, that person killed me again. Okay. Yep. So, you may have a bit of a rough start in this game, honestly. Um... That's definitely my experience so far, if you haven't been able to tell. Um, at least with this game. May be able to do that. Yep, so I just became a really large orb. Um, Want to go away from this guy here. Um, so you might want to split. Not really a good way to recombine in this game. Oh, and I just got on a, a thing, um, thing. Yeah, so I have to continue sort of collecting here. I think I can. Oh, 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 that person killed me. Okay. Um, yeah, basically that's sort of the gameplay. The more, the bigger you get, the slower you go, and then you start, you like rapidly lose power or whatever. Um, that person burst there. Oh no. Um. 
Okay, so I've mastered recombining in this game. It's fairly difficult. Um, yes, but I think this game actually does have a fair amount of skill level, more than it may seem, during the strategies. You can also, like, sort of shoot out smaller orbs. It's another thing you can do. Um, I don't know. Let's see, so I probably want to go after the smaller orb here. Unfortunately, the bigger... I ain't calling it blob. Um, I think the game's official name is actually Cell. I don't know how this really represents a cell. It doesn't really seem like it, but... I guess that's what the game creators call it. Sorry for a second there if the microphone was a bit um, quiet. See, so like if you're you have to be if you're like about the same size, you can't like glob people or whatever. I just grew a bit there. Um, now I can go after. Oh, this looks pretty interesting. Um, ah, oh, dead there. Let's see. Let's try a teams match. So I think there's about three teams. Um, unfortunately, it's not showing my name here. I think they disable that so it's easier to tell who's on what team. Oh, I died there. Now I'll show off this mechanic here. And if I get some globs here, if I press W, um, wait. So yeah, if I press W, uh, See here, just collecting a bit. See, so anyway, so if I press W, it'll release an orb, which I can go and pick up again if I want to. Um, oh, that's that's really weird. <laughs> it's really scary. Um, one another complaint about this game is like, I sometimes wish I could just see sort of the perspective of it. Like they have the spectator mode, but it sort of seems broken currently. Um, can't just sort of spectate the entire board. And these things here, I'll just show it off. These will break your orb, like entire orb up. So you really want to avoid those. So, <laughs> um, yep, I think I can collect this. Unless that, that person's on my same team. You can't collect, um, orbs that are on your same team in team mode, obviously, because that, that would be overpowered, I guess. Uh. <coughs> I think I'm going to do a bit more free-for-all. Now I can be, I can be doge again. <laughs> oh yeah, it's, it's definitely one of my favorite features. Um, the naming thing, it's definitely pretty cool. Of course, it's more of a fun feature, but still. Um, especially when there's a giant doge. Much doge. And many doge. This is much Canada. Many China. I think that's China down there. Sorry if I'm being culturally insensitive or something. I don't know. I just don't know what flag that is.
I somehow missed that thing there. Um, let's see there. Sort of the little recombine. Sometimes these sort of grouped up things are the best by far way to just get rich quick, I guess. But yeah, I'm probably going to, once I end this video, play this for another 10 hours. Um, anyway, so I think I'm going to end the episode here. I guess that's why I did that. I'd block. Block sads. <laughs> Um, anyway, so I'm gonna e end the episode here. Um, as always, thank you for watching. Um, I guess I'll see you in the next video, which will most likely be next week. Um, I'm not sure about that. But I'm trying to make a video every week, like over the weekend. Because weekdays are just too hard to make videos. Um, especially, like, in the summer I'll be making a lot of videos. Uh, sorry for that rant.